Good morning guys, it's Em and I'm here to do a what I ate on vegan day two as well as a weigh in video for you all. So I weighed in today. I'm sorry if I start seizing because my allergies are horrible again today. I weighed in today at, okay sorry, I'll go from last week. I weighed in last week at 173.6 um, and then this week I weighed in at 172.5. So I'm down 1.1 and with Weight Watchers I've lost 49.1 in total so 0.9 and I hit my 50 pounds next week I hope to do at least 2.6 pounds then I'll be in the 160s and I will also have my 50 pound charm so that is my goal I'm thinking I can probably do more than 2.6 this week with the vegan challenge but I don't want to get too excited about anything um, after my weigh-in it's 10 37 I haven't eaten anything yet I had a 1.2 one smart point iced coffee had one cup of creamy cashew in here and then it had two tablespoons of my sugar-free vanilla syrup I am going to mow down on some raspberries and mango I'm not sure if I'm going to eat all of this but um, I couldn't think of what else to have and I'll make something healthy and maybe something with avocado when I get home so I'm gonna have this and I will chat with you guys later guys so I am just leaving Taco Bell so I'm just leaving Taco Bell and I got the seven bean or the seven seven layer burrito I got it fresco style I got it with beans um, and then I took off the sour cream and cheese um, and that means they added more f tomatoes I believe so I just ran it through the app and it does 11 smart points. I asked for it to be on the grill as well so it's a little bit toasty and then I got a Diet Pepsi. Um, I wasn't planning to get takeout for lunch but um, I wasn't, originally I hadn't planned to stay in town all the way to my Cairo appointment. I thought I would just come back but this morning I was going to come to town with my friend and I had to turn around and bring her back because she found out she had a work meeting to go to so I just it was a lot of driving and I just didn't want to um, and the mango I bought wasn't ripe which I ate it all and then the raspberries were really soggy and I, I like my raspberries quite firm so I didn't eat the raspberries and yeah so I'm gonna try to try this ooh this good it's hefty hopefully it's not too messy Mmm. Guys. If you're vegan and you haven't tried this. Mmm. This is really good. ahead and eat this and I will chat with you guys in a bit. Alright guys, Taco Bell's vegan menu is no joke. So yummy. And I'm really impressed with my choice <laughs> and the fact that I even ordered it right and figured it all out on a crunch. So I had been watching some people's videos about like they tried the Taco Bell vegan menu so I had an idea of what I could do. But I wasn't sure if they kind of advertised it the same in Canada. So I googled it quick when I was in the drive-thru. Oh guys, it was so good. I put a little bit of the mild and hot sauce on it. Like in between every few bites. But it was definitely like a decent size. Like and 11 points for a lunch is not bad. Especially with Weight Watchers. Like I only have 30 points a day. I know that what I want to have for dinner is a little hefty. Um... I am going to attempt a vegan Big Mac. I know now my day doesn't look super healthy, but um, it's vegan. It's with quinoa and pinto bean patties. I'm making vegan mayo to make the special sauce. And maybe what I'll do is I'll just not double stack my Big Mac. I do have the points to have it after this. Um, I just don't know. We'll see how I feel or if I feel like I need to have something else in between here and then. But yeah, 
and I'm very impressed with myself on day two of this vegan challenge and I'm excited and I'll talk to you guys later. So I'm attempting to make a vegan Big Mac. I've got my Pinto quinoa burgers started in the pan. I got three more smushed here and my messy kitchen now. Um, I've got two more here that I've got to do so I'm going to do three at a time. Um, while I've started those I'm going to get some stuff tidied up and start the um, special okay, sauce. Okay guys, here's my dinner. This is the Pinterest vegan Big Mac. I just did the points. It's 18 smart points. It's the same amount of points as a regular Big Mac. I hope it tastes as good as a regular Big Mac. Um, this will leave me with one smart point left for my day. If I'm not liking how it tastes, then I might not eat it all. Um, but I will let you guys know when it's done. I'm so full. I'm not gonna eat this last piece. It was good, but I think that the burger patties for this recipe for me is just too strongly flavored like with the seasonings. I probably would prefer something a little bit more natural tasting. Not even necessarily like meat, but I would have almost rather just like a bean taste than the seasonings that it called for. Anyways, it was really good. The special sauce is really good. Um, I didn't mind the dairy-free cheese either, but what I'm gonna do is just take off three points, I think, for my dinner. The whole thing was 18, and it was maybe like, maybe like an eighth of it. I don't know. I'm just gonna take off three points because there's still like a lot of sauce in there and a lot of burger and bun, so. I'll just say three points off of, and that leaves me with four points for my day and I gotta go get my kids so I will chat with you guys later. Hey guys, so it's about 6.30. I am just going out. I wanted to get some, I wanted to get some mason jars so I could organize all my spices in them because my spice cupboard is just a huge mess and it's like all the little baggies just everywhere and I can't see what's going on so I want to get those and try to tackle that tonight um, my hip has been so bad my first Cairo visit was good but my hip was sore before and it's still sore after so I might just have to take a Tylenol for it that vegan Big Mac was pretty good um, I would only say that I'm not really used to having like a quinoa bean burger and the spices that I put in it weren't necessarily to my liking. I think next time I did it, I would probably just put like garlic and the nutritional yeast and maybe a little bit of um, something like red pepper flakes or something to make it a bit spicy. I know that it's not Big Mac to do that, but I don't really like the spices that I'm making it taste more like Indian style. I don't know I even know what I'm saying, but anyways. Um, and also if I was to do it, I would just use a bun. I wouldn't use the half bun in the middle and I would only use one patty. That way it would cut down the points. I'm not hungry by any means and I have three points, no four points left for my day. Um, but I just don't think I need to be eating that many points. That is that. Anyways, I, I'm at the dollar store now. And I will talk to you guys when I'm done. So I'm gonna go ahead and close up this vlog. I have three smart points left. I realized when I was talking about having four earlier, I hadn't tracked my iced coffee from this morning. So um, having said that, I have three left. I'm not hungry. If I do have anything else tonight, it might just be some fruit or some water. And yeah, I will check in with you guys tomorrow and have a wonderful day. Bye.